The Apex Legends Anniversary Collection event was supposed to end on February 23rd, but Respawn decided to extend it after players made it clear they wanted more time to collect all the rewards. Because there is so much to collect, players had a hard time collecting everything before the February 23 deadline. Fortunately, Respawn heard the thousands of pleas and decided to extend the event for an additional week. The reverse date for the end of the collection event is March 2nd. Now moving on to the update released yesterday. Apex Legends rolled out a small update, version 1.59, on February 22nd, fixing some of the broken skin textures for characters, as well as some other stability fixes. Since Season 8 dropped, players have been experiencing a number of frustrating issues in Apex Legends, none more so than the dreaded infinite loading screen, which prevents players from logging in. The only workaround for this at a moment seems to be totally resetting your system, which is far from ideal. Unfortunately, this latest patch, 1.59, doesn't fix this issue yet, but the developers are still investigating the problem. The main purpose of the 1.59 update in Apex Legends was to fix the broken skins players had been seeing in first-person view. This bug was affecting skins with Bloodhound, Loba, Lifeline and more. Although the skins looked perfectly normal to everyone else, in first person, the hands of the character appeared as just plain grey. Other than this, there wasn't much else to get excited about in this update. Respawn say the only other improvements were some stability fixes. The developers noted that they were still investigating login bugs. Other bugs being investigated, as per their Trello board, include missing red dots, an increase in slow mo servers, and even a rare bug where players lose all their cosmetics. There's also been an increase in players reporting an issue that prevents them from being able to loot death boxes. We'll keep you up to date with fixes for these issues, which should be coming in a future update.